Happy St. Patrick's Day! So today is St. Patrick's Day and we figured that we would go ahead and show all the places that are actually Irish owned businesses that you can support on St. Patrick's Day instead of just, you know, getting blindly drunk somewhere on the street for St. Patrick's Day. I don't think they can do that now. True, COVID, actually, probably <laughs> true. Maybe next year, maybe. Yeah, you can save it for next year. This year, you can go out and you can support an Irish-owned business, maybe one of the ones that we're going to show you today. So let's get right to it. Let's go show yes. restaurants you can support. Let's St. go. Patrick's. All right, guys, we're at our first place of the day. I don't know if you can see that. It is the Irish Times. It looks very Irish. <laughs> yeah, it's very, it's very, it's we Irish We actually owned. saw a family coming out from the car and they were wearing a Irish hat and the kids with the green stuff. See, people celebrating here. Yes. You should too, maybe. We're about to go inside. We're gonna check out the menu, check out the food to get, and then we'll see uh, what we think. So we're just starting with the kombucha. I think it has alcohol. It's called the no Nova. I don't remember. Or something like that, I think. We wanted the coffee, Irish coffee, but it was out today, so next time. No Irish coffee here. <laughs> next time. Next time. Alright, guys, we got the Irish got breakfast. Eggs. It's a full Irish breakfast, so I think we got everything we can from an Irish place. So we got scrambled eggs. We have ham, sausage, potatoes, tomatoes, uh, we got uh, black and white pudding, we got beans and toast, we got it all. And uh, we got There's this the beans one. and toast. Can't wait to try it. Interesting. Ooh, it's hot. It's pretty hot. <laughs> Is everything tasting okay? Yeah, can yes. we just get a salt and pepper? Absolutely, I'll be right Oh, I never had them. Well, I mean, I like beans. We have something like that in Brazil. It's pretty similar, actually. It's pretty good. You want to try? Are you being sarcastic? <laughs> no. It's filming. <laughs> I know. It's hot. Hot. Mm. Yeah, it's pretty good, actually. I was worried because I'm not. No, I like. I'm not big on beans. Name. I'm not big on beans. We love beans in Brazil, so I think that's why I like it. But. It's actually pretty good. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Alright right, guys, we cleaned the plate. I don't know if you can see that, but finished everything. It was an Irish, complete Irish breakfast. And it was great. Favorite parts. The beans, surprisingly, do taste delicious. I'm never really for beans, but yeah, the well, beans I mean, taste uh, pretty good. Being a vegan, of course, I couldn't eat the whole plate. Yeah, there's a lot though. of meats that but maybe she wouldn't like to eat or anything like that. Yeah. But she still, you know, tried a little bit of everything. The beans is great for me. If you're vegan, I have like this cooked toast and beans. It was interesting to try to yeah, yeah, three different kinds of meats, yes. eggs, toast, beans, okay, definitely. So about going somewhere and St. Patrick's Day. They make this your spot. Did you guys enjoy everything? Yes. Did they know we got St. Patrick's Day celebration coming up? Yeah. We're going to have the, uh, seven tables out front and the whole parking lot. Oh, great. Oh, yeah. Wow. And it's always a big to do, so we'll see how it is this year for COVID. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, you see, you guys, you know. Yeah, I don't know if you guys remember, but they're doing a huge St. Patrick's Day all right guys we just finished eating at the irish times uh not sure if yeah, you guys ever had an irish breakfast before so we got the full irish breakfast that's right a lot of meat full of meat so if you're potatoes, vegan potatoes <laughs> beans uh, but it was great uh, yeah, it was bread or toast and uh eggs and uh yeah, yeah it's interesting never really had it before the kombucha was great she also got homemade. a kombucha um i guess it's homemade yeah. brew here yeah. uh, and the beans was interesting yeah, this is unlike anything I've ever had in terms of beans. I think before. I never actually had uh, ours like that, but it, it reminds me a little bit of American breakfast with eggs and potatoes and meat. So, and, and they're also doing a St. Patrick's Day celebration oh, here yes. in so the parking lot. Like it's COVID compliant, so if you're thinking about 
spending St. Patrick's Day, you should do it here. We'll yes. tag them and everything like that. All right, let's head out to the next place. All right, guys, we are at the next place. I don't know if you can read that. It's Sunny McLean's Irish Pub. We're in Santa Monica and Los Angeles. This we're place going. looks very cute. Yes, it does look very <laughs> nice. Photos look very nice. They have a nice outdoor eating area. We're gonna go check that out right now. We're inside Sunny McLean's. It's very cool today, actually. It's very surprising. We're having some trouble to do a video here. We're trying to sneak in a private table, but we couldn't. Here, look. This is the sandwich. We got the corn, beef, hash sandwich. It's freaking packed. Go ahead. Very meaty, too. Take a bite. I'll take a bite. Oh my goodness, let's see it, let's see it. Alright, thoughts? Thoughts? It's good. Yeah. Really? Alright. Ah, I'm surprised. Alright guys, food's good. We got the corned beef sandwich as you guys had just seen. Nice big old bite, and surprisingly, <laughs> she said it was yeah, really good. Even though it has meat as well, I'm not a meaty person, but it wasn't actually the taste of the meat, it was strong. It was so a actually, lot was of stuff in the like sandwich. It. It was, so it was all together, it was, it was actually a, a pretty good sandwich. Recommend it. Maybe for your St. Patrick's Day, come check it out at Sunny McLean's Irish Pub. And outside is very cute, and yes. I actually had a lot of people there. Too. Actually, so you know it's yeah. probably good food. We tried to do a video inside, but because a lot of people, so <laughs> it's like, oh. Yeah, it's, it's kind of whatever. They have heat, la uh, heat lamps and everything, so in case you get cold, nice heat inside. And uh, let's go to the next place. All right, guys, we are at our next place. This is Tom Bergen's Irish Pub. You don't have anything to say, do you? <laughs> no, I'm just waiting. Let's go eat. Yeah, let's just let's just get inside. Let's go eat and uh, see what's on the menu. Hey guys, all right, we got our first thing from Tom Morgan's. We got the famous iced coffee. That's right. How is it? Mm. Most importantly, I forgot they have alcohol, right? <laughs> nice and warm too, because it's a it's a pretty chilly day here in Los Angeles. So nice. <laughs> I don't know why, you're not expecting it, there's a wolf. Oh yeah, baby. And then we got the... We got uh, shepherd's famous, pie. Yeah, pie. Yeah, yeah. We got shepherd's pie to eat. We're going to show you guys that in just a second. Alright guys, we just got our second thing after the Irish coffee. Very meaty too. Like, I think all Irish food are very meaty. It's the shepherd's pie. Let's give it a little taste test. Oh my vegan diet. Oh my god, yeah, it is. It's steaming. Confirmation, it is good. Reminds me of my mom's food back in Brazil. Like a beef stew, kind of, yeah, kind of yeah, like a beef, beef stew, stew yeah. kind of thing. You might notice we're not sitting down right now. They do have outdoor seating over there, um, but it's kind of, it is, it's pretty cold outside. Uh, and we are figured out, it, I mean, it's not about dining in, it's just about supporting these uh, Irish-owned restaurants for St. Patrick's Day. So, if you're celebrating St. Patrick's Day, if you're thinking about doing something, thinking about drinking, thinking about doing anything, try choosing one of these places that we've shown you guys today, or maybe there's another one near you or open that we may not have found. But all of these, you know, they have something to offer, they have something going on, or they have something to buy for you know to drink or to eat so try to support an actual irish owned restaurant pub whatever for st patrick's day thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys next time oh it's hot it's hot it's hot it tastes good i got a little piece <laughs>